Now that we've removed the window, we want to check around in the framing members to make sure we don't have any rot or decay. The most vulnerable spot is right where the rough sill meets the trimmer stud. At that point, once we know that we're structurally sound, we're ready to install the sill flashing. Next, we're going to check the rough sill to make sure it's level. Given that this is a remodel application, we want to make sure that our sill is as level as possible horizontally. And then we also want to make sure that the sill is dead flat or has some positive slope to the exterior. Next, we're going to apply the apron. In a remodel application, we might have a condition where the weather resistant barrier is damaged or has holes in it. So we're going to apply an apron to the bottom before we build the sill pan. The apron should be a mechanically fastened piece of flashing, not an adhesive backed. The reason for that is we're going to want to lift the apron up possibly later to put either the existing or a new weather resistant barrier underneath it so that everything sheds water in weatherboard fashion. 